Hi guys, we're here for an uh, update on the Rommel's Rod and we're going to do a couple of shop card ads before we get started on that and uh, maybe a little bit more. So first up from Corey we have Dream Build, Dream Big, Build Small. Sorry guys, I had to like you sometime. Uh, address at dream build, dream big, build small at gmail.com. Uh, check out his channel on YouTube. He's also on Facebook and Instagram. And he says, on the back he enjoys watching my videos. He loved the 57 Chevy we built for the 48 hour um, group build and happy modeling. Thank you very much, Corey. We will go. That will go into our our folder with, with everybody else's shop cards. We keep keep track of those. Keep a collection going. And also, we got from Joey Collins. We got the one arm bandit. We got shop card from Joey at Joey's Hobby Shop. We got kind of a barn find looking looking truck on the front of that. He's on YouTube. He hosts uh, a, a live stream on Sunday nights. If you want to jump in and get involved with that, they're usually pretty fun. I go in and get most of my modeling done for the week while I'm sitting in a live stream because I'm at the bench, uh, at the bench shooting the bull and, and building while I'm going. Uh, he says, "Thanks for the kit and the awesome shop cards. You're a good person with a heart of gold." Thank you, Joey. I appreciate that. Appreciate that very much. This week I also picked up some things for upcoming builds. I haven't decided which one, which one will go where yet, but um, I've got two of the Jimmy Funstone uh, 2006 Camaro conversions for the for the Firebird coming up. So I got two sets of Pontiac wheels. I got a set of the honeycombs and a set of the 80s, the late 80s uh, Pontiac star wheels. I'm not sure which one, I, which one I'll use on those. Or I also do have a set of snowflakes. Um, but I think I want to use these on the 82 that I have. Just one second, guys. Uh, got let me back up here. I got this uh, 2017 50th anniversary Camaro that I'm going to do as well. So the, I got the 2006. I'm going to convert into the Firebirds, the Jimmy Flintstone kits. But I'm also going to do the Camaro, and I got rather than using the stock wheels. I thought I'd put, use these. I just think they look cool. The pit wheels don't look bad. I mean, what they came, what the Camaros came with. I just think these will, these will be sharper, and I'm, I may color code them rather than paint them chrome. Uh, I'm not sure yet if I'm going to make them the. The graphite color that that the car is, or if I'm going to make make them chrome, because that would be chrome would stand out well because it's the only chrome piece on the whole car. Then I kind of like the blacked out look too. So we'll we'll decide when that when that point comes. Um, So we got those say uh, for the I talked to them at Jimmy Flintstones. They're supposed to be sending me uh supposed to be getting those kits are supposed to ship this week. So I'll have those to show hopefully by the end of the week or early next week. And I'm probably gonna do depending on how much work they're gonna take to get them ready. 
I'd like to have one of them done as my use as my cancer awareness build and have it ready to go to Acme in the end of October. So with this coming in, um, the next couple of weeks I don't know if I'll have have time to get it get it ready for that for that or not. Anyway, for our waffle too long, we went been working on our Rommel's rod. You can see it kind of piled up back there in the corner. Um, it's basically done. So I got to do final assembly. I just put the decals on on this evening. Here you can see I've got the decals on the flags. I still got to paint the poles. We've got our machine guns are, are ready to go. Our headlight covers. I debated whether or not if I wanted to put regular glass in there or, or use these, but it says that it is a Tom Daniels, so we'll, we'll go ahead and go with those. Um, you won't be able to see him, but I got the uh, the skull hood ornament. I got him all redone. Uh, he had a her terrible seam on his head. The, the seam went this way around it, so I had to uh, see if I can zoom in on him a little bit. Focus. Go out a little bit. There we go. Yeah, it had a horrible seam on around right both sides of his head, and then so I had to strip strip him down, sand that, sand and file that seam, and then uh, that's the AK Super Chrome that we put back on there. And I put a coat of put a coat of Future on that. So that when I go in and uh, put a wash on to fill in his eyes and, and his nose hole and that stuff, uh, it won't affect the chrome. That's him. Get the rest of the grill we've got ready here. I'm going to zoom back out. This is still the cat chrome. I didn't go ahead and I didn't change it. But I did put... So I gotta go back and clean it up. I, I did put some Tamiya black panel line into the radiator grill. I still gotta, I gotta go back and polish it. Eat it off the tops. So there's that. We got our spare tire. It goes on the on the fender. And if you're easily offended, look away now because. Here's the rest part of our spare tire cover. And yes, it does have a swastika on it because, you know, that's... It is what it is. That's the way it was. So that's... If it belongs there, it's going to be there. That's And that's all I got to say about that. Uh, we got our front wheels here. We, uh... Think about it, I just stuck it away. I uh, painted the whole car with the Tamiya uh, sand color. Let me see which one it was. I, and we're back. Sorry, guys. I had to dig, wanted to dig it out so I could. So we used a Tamiya paint for it. We used uh, light sand TS46. Is what we used, which is basically. Almost the same color as the plastic. The plastic was a little bit more, I want to say green. I'm sure the camera won't even pick it up. This part down here was not painted. Uh, but we decided to give it that little more of a desert color. I wasn't the uh, yellow that it was molded in yellow sandy color was all right, but it just wasn't quite what I wanted. Uh, so we we shot it with that. Uh, Say so we just put the decal. Yep. So we got our our wheels here. It's kind of interesting. I got it painted now. It doesn't show, but the half of the back of the back of the wheel is plastic, and half of it is in the front is rubber. It's kind of like those. Uh, some of the kits have the white walls that, that snap in that are plastic. They're kind of like that. 
we got that, we got a spare there. Our hood, as I talked about in the last video, I went ahead and glued it as one piece. Uh, now it's the clear coats on there, we're gonna, we're gonna get ready to do weathering on the rest of it. We'll put some weathering on here and some weathering on the on the belt to uh, make that look all, look all snazzy. Uh, on our chassis, we got the treads section on. The engine is still just sitting in there, and we got the roller bumper on the front. Uh, it does it does turn, but it's, you know whatever. We got the Daimler diesel in there built. Uh, the exhaust pipes come out the side here, go through the hood and down into the fender. Uh, there is no under fender detail for the muffler. I may or may not build something for that. It just they just come out the bottom and that's the end of it. Uh, and then for the body itself, we've got got it all painted up. I said it's in gloss coat now because I just put the decals on there. In fact, they're still wet. And I have obviously haven't put the guns in it and stuff like that. Because uh, we were once those decals dry overnight, we will do a, a clay wash on that, a brown clay clay wash to bring out the details. Um, we've got our steering wheel here, which uh, I'll put in again after we. I want to hit that with the. It's still the kick chrome. I want to go ahead and hit it with the hit it with the AK Super Chrome to make it match everything else. Um, it's kind of cool that all the all the decals, decals, water slide transfers, whatever your preferences, all say what they're supposed to say. Uh, no steps. Step here. Uh, the tools. You know, it's all got extra treads on the back, got a license plate. They all say what they're supposed to say. We got our fuel tanks, fuel extra fuel cans on the side of there. It's like a cool little kit. And uh that tomorrow we'll be able to <coughs> excuse me, we'll be able to weather it. And uh then we'll get a coat of coat of flat put on it and she will be ready except for the skeletons and that's about it on that guys the uh the announcement video on the cancer awareness group build will drop on friday you'll be able to see all the details there if you uh would like to get a copy of the of the banner page for your use for your uh, title page on your videos or in your videos let me know uh, Kenny Mae was kind enough to put that together and I'd be more than happy to share it with you <coughs> with that guys I'm gonna say good morning good evening good night wherever you are where you're watching this video and we will see you on the next one oh, there's a couple of pictures too at the end good night guys